Hi, it's Mark Homan from Paul's Photo, the Creative Photo Academy in the lab at Paul's Photo. Happy Monday, everybody. It's day 319 of our Be Creative series. My wife found these beautiful blue glasses on sale. Bought a dozen of them. I don't know why she thought I would like blue glasses, but I just thought, I guess she thought I would. But um, what I like about being a photographer is taking an ordinary subject like the blue glasses here and turning that into a picture. So what have we got? We've got one of the Lytra Torch 2s down here with the diffuser on it. Two of the Lytra Pro Torches with the barn doors on it. I have the Nikon 70-200 to on the Z7 II on my tripod lined up. And you notice the glasses are at this odd arrangement. I started out with a triangle, kind of like bowling pins, and it didn't work because it didn't fill the frame. So, why do I have the lights? Because I'm going to turn down the house lights and look what happens here. And if you notice, I've arranged the glasses, went away from the bowling pin configuration. Why? To make it so the glasses filled the frame. So the back glasses are kind of spread out a little bit differently. So I'm at aperture F11 ISO 400 with a minus two thirds exposure compensation. That's going to give a shutter speed of about half a second. We've got focus right here on the front glass and I'm just going to do a touch shoot and I want to show you what it looks like at f11, right? Now I'm going to change the f-stop to f22. Shutter speed is going to get longer, but what's going to happen is in the picture, there's f22, more focus, there's f11, less focus. So now we're going to go the other way. We went through 11. We're going to go to f5.6. Focus right there and shoot. Let's look at that. Wow. Now we're going to go to f-stop 2.8. Open the aperture all the way up. Touch focus right there. Right? So there's f2.8. Sorry. f2.8. f5.6. f11. F22. Pretty amazing when you see that difference. And that's why I like a real camera. I like the creativity of knowing what the f-stops -stop, and shutter speeds are going to do. So that's how I can make my picture. What picture are you going to do? What's going to inspire you? Find some glasses. Find some something to drink and make a picture. Mark Komen from Paul's Photo, the lab at Paul's Photo and the Creative Photo Academy wishing you Happy Monday, great fun, and let's be creative together.